So, oh, oh my goodness! <laughs> Should have seen it coming. A crit stable. Uh, uh, that is true, yeah. It's going to be interesting to see the, uh, the fly, yes. Oh, they're hit by the top rear spot. They're going to see a kick off already. Fly leaning in onto mind control. The stun yeah, coming back in for itself. Mind control falling low. OG looks to take the first, but they will. No tail on the Meepo, getting himself the first kill of the game. Mid lane at the moment, Miracle still winning lane on the timber top. Gonna go in onto mind control. They've got the setup with the net. We'll see if they can finish this one off. Fly looking for the body block. No tail nice as well block. with the micro block. It up the Nyx assassin and OG will take it. No tail. Well in the laning phase, it's whether or not the Nyx assassin is enabled enough for him to have an impact. Nyx assassin is a pretty questionable hero uh, right now, just because well he's gotten some small buffs up, it just doesn't seem enough for him to really be able to control the game. Mind control. They're really trying for this yeah. one. They might get it. He's bringing no tail low with the heal on the summary as well. No tail. He's got to get himself fouled with the eye heal. He's going to be able to get just away. Fly nice will be as lucky now with the rotation with Jerex. They may be able to find more good right. stuff from Mind Control. Catching out Crit and No tail. Crit's going to go down. Can they get the Meepo as well? He's stuck in the tree line. Mind Control looking for the block off. They're going to be able to get the third. Just cleaning up this lane here. Great play and great rotation there from Jerex. All of Father's last hits are actually from the neutrals more or less. Look at this No tail. He finds himself an image. Makes you of it straight away to pick off the Timber Man with the help of Fly Moon. Miracle keeps coming over it's just to just disrupt these it's kind of juggling. In fact, Jax Miracle needs to be careful. Jerry. Huge amounts of burst. Meanwhile, Tolin Mind Control gets himself away from Vendetta, but Miracle what? plays around the town. So getting the kill on Jarax. Let's see if they can, they can do anything else for that. As now. Lost the ultimate, trying for the armlet toggling. It's going to keep him alive. Miracle still playing around. He's only got a little bit of mana left. And Miracle actually going to go down there by the looks of it. He I has zero chill. Someone needs to die. <laughs> What's going on? This is a weird game. It's early, boys. Mike Our Control's already used up. his uh, Vendetta, so he has to try and TP escape. That's obviously That's... not going to work unless you hit both meepos. Yeah, this man, he's uh, looking to be a dead man. It's by Carapus, though. Will find time. And oh, okay, he's good. Kuroki. Kuroki turns up. And Mike Control actually looking to to come back in potentially, but OG, that's coming in with the TPs, stun. he's got to be careful. Matuma Man is here as well, they're looking to fight Liquid, they'll jump in, straight away, looks to take no tail out, they'll find it, but at the same time, Man, oh, the graves in time! Matuma Man's going to be able to live in there, looking for more, stuff from my troll, it's great, they'll find themselves a double kill for oh, beautiful and Mike miracle, control. he's going to go down as well, a huge heal bomb from Kuroki! <laughs> there we have it, I mean, 19 minutes in, Liquid. Powering down onto the tier threes of OG. And you've got to kind of ask yourself, what do OG do to stop this kind of push at this early stage of the game? Well, they've got to, I mean, they're really close to having like Blink Dagger or No Tail that changes the game pretty dramatically where they have this big burst damage, but it sucks that they're going to lose a lane of racks before that. Trying to jump in onto the Tumba Man, but the Tumba Man jumps straight back in onto No Tail. They've lost the Meepo. Coming in with a Supernova on the back lines as well. And OG, they can't take it down. They'll lose the second and third. Game. OG needs something bigger. No tail. It's going to be a dieback. Stunned up, taken down. Moon That's as well. it. Game over. GG. What a performance from Liquid in a series that I think a lot of people would have expected to be incredibly close. But game one coming into this, Liquid, they're just on another level today. Nine. Top lane. Oh, excuse me, chat. They've caught out Moon here. The stun into the hex. Liquid looking for first blood. They'll find it. Jerax, more than enough control to deal with this off lane beast. Level six by eight minutes. This is just all thanks to the, the space that Darkseer has kind of given him. He can be really high impact, but OG are going to strike first. Uh, straight on top. No messing as Moon drops the roar. Gets the kill onto the line, but Matuma Man is there, and TPs will be coming through. Liquid, they're looking to punish OG's play here. Straight onto the Moon. And they'll find the beast mark. To kill. So the score is 6-6 six, six, and actually Tau's in, in favor of Liquid against the lineup that you would assume would, would push them a lot. Oh, I'm try and on to Vada here, but I mean, he, he's just going to walk it off the time being. They need more damage. They do have an Omni Slash. Why are they, they doing this? With the counter by Trick of the Train from Kuroki Crit. He's got down and now Liquid. They'll move on to No Tail as well. They're ready to continue this fight. OG are scattering here as they realize this may not be the fight that they were looking for. Miracle trying to get himself nice up with a stun across the tree line from Jerax controlling the big bad wolf. The fact that they have four heroes perfectly located around a double target that should easily go down. Now Miracle getting jumped on immediately. Fly will be there with the swap, but Fly, he's been hexed up. Great control for Jerax and they'll lose a second. OG. Oh, look at the smoke gang coming up into the dire jungle now. If they pick off these two heroes, that can very well be uh, OG knocking on the liquid side of the base.
They should know about this, but they're not going to be fast enough with the retreat. It seems like the swap should be there. Yeah, I'm bringing him back. But some of that, can he play his way out this one? No, he cannot. Immediate jump in from OG. See if they can get into more. Miracle's got a DT. Moving in with the shape shift. Jump forward. Mooney's looking for the raw target. He'll pop it onto the bristle bag to contain him. Usman comes through and put a huge amount of damage. OG ripped the bristle back to pieces. And Kuroki, he's going to go as well. And OG, oh, the stop. from the illusions. I mean, the combo was pretty. Trying to defend against a push and split push the enemy. You force the TP back, and as soon as that happens, your offlaner, who's split pushing away, comes back to the base, and you smoke up, and you push out and see what you can catch while you know the enemy team is separated. Liquid, they had, they knew that was kind of in mind. They just didn't retreat fast enough, and one cut, one catch like that, we, we talked about it before. Oh, nice vacuum there from Ancholo, clipping two of them. Fly. He's going to get focus down first. The X control on to Miracle. They're looking to find a second on this defense, but a good stomp from the Elder Titan, holds back the remainder of them. And to my man, he's gonna continue the chase there, Miracle. Uh, he's still gonna be able to get himself out of this one with the open wounds down on him. Liquid will pick up two. Not gonna be the case here. They wrap back through, I think, and attempt to catch anybody still and set themselves up for Roshan. They got a pick. Straight on to Jerex here. Necro unit sat. Jerex just melts here to the level three Necros. Artis coming in from the backside. Pops the Shivas, but Miracle immediately with the ult starts to run. Crit, try, they try and jump on him, but they don't get the lock on. And now no tell with the Omni Slash jumping in onto him. To my man, Miracle jumps away. The Grease keeping alive the time, but he'll still go down. There's your vacuum wall, but again, where's the follow up from Liquid? They need to get more damage out. OG control. Controlling the fight perfectly at this stage. Crick coming in with a huge ult, slamming Fada and Michael Jolly in the face. The swap from Fly bringing Fada back into the center of the fight. The axes come out. Can they kill this man? Shiva's out again, but no tell. In with the crits, takes him down. They will lose Fly, but big kills for OG. This is now 70 seconds with the bristle on the sidelines. But Tumaman's come back into the fight, will be surged away. OG looking to Kuroki, jumps back across to mind control. Yeah, this is. This is a risky window now without this Bristol Bat Liquid. They need to find something good. And they have to find this and pick And they've got it. They've got the Hex. Cancels the stun. Miracle, he's not going to be able to live with one round. The finger's there. Huge position. Oh, oh, he is! He is! Crit with the saves. I mean, the stomp, Blink the four stuff. They almost have him. They're They need this kill. Jax, will Hex up Crit. They will kill the Elder Titan and Mind Control with the chase down. We'll see if Miracle has any way of playing his way around this one. He's actually just going to turn try and buy into Mind Control, but it's not going to work. It's a double bait. So it's going to be the first hit caught. Swap onto the tower. Of the, the Necro unit is from the front, bashing in the face of the Bristle. Now OG, see if they can move forward for more. Immediate fight back from Fud on the Bristle, knowing that he's going to be needed in this team fight. Trick the trade. Kuroki jumps across, trying to get himself out. They need he's the Bristle the, to reach the fight. He's got a fresh primal roar. But defused all down on Kuroki. Matuma Man jumps out. Kuroki will be the first to fall. The ult from Crick coming in, catching out Liquid, and now the Omni Slash ripping through Matuma Man. He's trying to run with the bashes there. It's the first defusal blade buyback from a two man. They know that they got to keep this battle up with the damage from OG, ripping the bristle to shreds. That's it. If they actually go through, and I think it's just over. Shielding the liquid. Oh, jumping in, finger. Almost no -tail. killed No-Tail, they eat this kill! But Tumor Man is chasing him, but he can't quite get it. They can't kill No-Tail, but Tumor Man tries to turn towards Crit, but now the rage is run out. He'll be forced away, but again, Crit with the stomp, catching him out. The second defusal charge, if they can kill this lifestealer, but Tumor Man just turning. Trying to man up, trying to fight against them, but the bash from No-Tail controlling with Tumor Man. He gets the second rage off. Kuroki's already on the back lines with the smoke screen, and they will keep a Tumor Man alive. To Liquid, oh, I can't get the stun from Jerax. He gets punished immediately. He's now dead without buyback. Kuroki's gone as well. They will have my control back up. Yeah, it's over. OG moving into the tier force. The push is just far too strong. And GG is cool. In a game where Liquid seemed to have the, the perfect opening, but OG, they played it so well. It's the two supports who do not. And, and thus he keeps on going back to hit them. Underneath the sentry, Chris coming with a rotation and they'll punish it. First blood for Crip. Nice reaction there. Look at top lane. Miracle's going to be caught though. The pounce is just barely going to latch. And that means Miracle will go down to these two cores unless he can somehow slip his way through the trees and go for a toss play. Oh but my god. There's no way, right? Oh, miracle. Nah, no he's having, he tries his best there. He really does. In the laning phase and it seems to have worked out. No tell. Maybe well, they're they just this. something up here. The follow through bottom smash. Oh, it's not going to catch my control in time. He gets the rage out. Moon is there with the roll, but Kuroki smoke screen stopping OG from being able to go full in. Magnetize is down onto my control and Kuroki crit trying to do it. I mean, this man playing around behind the tier twos. He's trying for the TPS, oh, but the no. tower hit flies through. Will lose his life.
Fader though, picking up his blink dagger. Again, oh, yes. finding things like this. Huge kill on Timmer Timmer Mount once more for OG. Mind control, trying to turn it, lock it down. Arthur Miracle, but it jumps in as well. No messing, they need to kill this tiny. RP skews him back under the tower. Follow up burst for Jarry's there, not messing. Everything dropped down onto the tiny to ensure the kill. As the Slark comes out as well, onto. They've got to get the initiation. And first and before Song of Siren. Oh, oh. they've got it great. Great Good skewer kill. timing. Very big kill as well. We'll just slow down the radius a little bit. He's still very close to the recipe, no doubt. At the same time, Liquid, they're going to find themselves another bit of fortune at crit. Can they finish it? Yes, they can. See here, Kroki, he knows Miracle's about. Matuma Man's going to start to move in, jumping in immediately with the Hex onto Miracle. Father gets the RP onto Fry, making sure that there's no save from the Dazzle, and Liquid fine too. Moon TP's away on the high ground. DC forces a rotation. He's not an important kill anyway, and it's not a kill that like allows Liquid to take control of the game. Yeah, at this point, he's like a glorified Beastmaster Hawk that can function as a taxi service, as you said <laughs> earlier, and then, of course, he has a, sm a smoke cloud for, for team fights. Right. Look at this here. I mean, OG, I th they know that the Lifestealer's in one of these, and he's about to pop. Oh, OG, they're ready to jump in. Here we go, Miracle looking to lead in with the combo, but Brian Control has got the rage, heads to the sidelines. Knows he's in a lot of trouble, though. There's no chance for a TP with Aurora available from Moon, and they will catch Mind Control there. Yeah, uh, I think they're just hesitant to fully force a fight. Just because they know they're giving Liquid the opportunity to take control of the game, whereas if things stay static, it's not possible. Kill him a second. Oh, great timing with this, but the sword, no tail, puts a halt on this fight. And OG, can there be anything in return? Matuma Man pops the BKB, looks towards Miracle. Jerex is there as well with the Hex. They're going to take down Miracle a second time. He's AC, so he's not like a full uh, physical damage carry in team fights just yet. He's still focused on burst, so. Eyes on to Moon. We'll set up the initiation for Liquid to come in. They'll take down the Ricky. Can OG do anything in return? Three man silence, but Matuma Man pops BKB, works his way into crit. Double kill now for the slot. No tell. He's popped the song. He's trying to run Matuma Man, looking to get a rage for the Abyss. Still blade, but the BKB runs out. No tail. OG wanting to try and make as much as they can happen with this Aegis on the Tiny. They're just heading. Heading in onto the man with the combo. Shooting back. Not going to catch anyone. And now with the raw to fight. A miracle with the right clicks. Bringing the Magnus down low, but he gets saved. Forced down twice. Back into the safety of his own base. So not losing anything here, but no tail. With the song. Trying to set something up for OG. Who are they going to look oh, to? Got the Great kick. stun onto the man instantly. And then take down the slot. He's dead. 90 seconds gone now, and this is a huge opening here for the side of OG. Now he's just had, he only just had the money now for the buyback. And it's just going to make things hard for Liquid, where they have to win so many team fights in a row, never make any mistakes, never give any openings for OG, because one small thing, even just, like, he just ran up and took a tier three real quickly. That's how quickly they can push. Great. Nice done in silence. Is Liquid for the ones trying to jump in on him. Now, moving in with the song. They're looking to turn this one around, OG. Yeah, they're going to back off. Yeah, they don't feel confident trying to go for the kill on Matumba, Matt. Just playing it very safe, OG. In fact, well, Vada, he's caught out no tail. Skews him back into the stun of Jerex. Can they actually bring down this man? The roar's out. Loads someone's no tail. They can't kill no tail at this point. And it's OG turning back in. Buy back from Jerex. He tried to return to the fight. They're going all in on no tail. But the grave is there from Fly. Buy him some more time. But Timmer Man's still trying to work away at this dog. And will finally find the kill. Miracle caught out by the Abyssal Blade. They're looking for more. It's a buyback. They're committing with the extra buyback. with the combo. Jerex gets the stun out. But OG now in a great position to continue this fight. The beat down, slap down, three dead on Liquid. Mind Control's gonna get taken down as well. And now in a position where only Fart is left standing with that buyback. Yeah. GG's gonna be called. Cool. It's all too much. And in a very patient game, it finally got to that point where OG were just able to push it over the edge with Liquid just going two in on a bad fight.